Jelma Pereira dies dos Santos, known simply as Jelma Santos, the 27th of February 1929 to 23 July 2013, was a Brazilian footballer who started for the Brazil national team and four World Cups. Winning two, in 1958 and 1962, Santos is considered to be one of the greatest right-backs of all time, while primarily known for his defensive skills. He often ventured upfield and displayed some impressive attacking skills, along with Franz Beckenbauer and Philipp Lamb. He is one of only three players to be included into three FIFA World Cup All-Star teams in 1954, 1958 and 1962. He was named by Pelé as one of the top 125 greatest living footballers in March 2004. Santos started his career in his hometown with Puerto Aguesa. He initially played in the center of defense but was later moved to the right side of defense. In 1959, he moved to Palmeiras. He played almost 500 games for the club. Winning several league and cup titles, he left the club in 1968, joining Atletico Paranaense for a short spell before retiring in 1970. Santos was never sent off during his entire career. Santos made 98 official appearances for Brazil between 1952 and 1968, and was in the squad for four consecutive World Cups between 1954 and 1966. He made his first appearance against Peru in the Pan American Championship. The match was drawn 0-0. Santos made his World Cup debut in a 5-0 win against Mexico, and played in all of Brazil's matches during the tournament. He scored his first goal for Brazil from the penalty spot in a 4-2 defeat against Hungary, also known as the Battle of Bern. Santos had lost his place in the side after being dropped in favor of De Sorti and did not play until the final against Sweden. Brazil won the match 5-2, with Santos being one of the outstanding performers as a result. Despite only playing one match in the tournament, he was included in the tournament's all-star team. Santos was once again a regular in the starting lineup, playing in all of Brazil's games. In the final against Czechoslovakia, he set up the final goal for Brazil noting that the Slovak goalkeeper William Shrojev was somewhat off his line, Santos lofted a long, massive, high-arcing ball into the goal mouth aided by the glare of the afternoon sun. Santos, now at the age of 37, was selected for a fourth consecutive World Cup. The inclusion of Santos in the squad was a surprise to some, with Carlos Alberto expected to be selected instead. Santos plays the first two games but was dropped after the 3-1 defeat to Hungary. Brazil were knocked out of the tournament in the next game against Portugal. Santos died on the 23rd of July 2013 in hospital in Uberba, where he had lived for two decades. He died due to pneumonia and severe hemodynamic instability, culminating with cardiac arrest, having been hospitalized since the 1st of July 2013.